हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू आर चैनल ऑनलाइन लर्निंग दिस वीडियो इज रिलेटेड टू कॉग्निज एंड टेक्निकल असेसमेंट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव एज वी नो दैट मैनी ऑफ द कैंडिडेट्स कम्प्लीटेड द एप्टीट्यूड असेसमेंट ऑन टूडे एंड एज वी नो दैट कम्युनिकेशन असेसमेंट ऑन सेवनटीन अप्रैल राउंड टू एप्टीट्यूड असेसमेंट ऑन ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट अप्रैल एंड टेक्निकल असेसमेंट ऑन ट्वेंटी सेकेंड अप्रैल अकॉर्डिंग टू योर परफॉर्मेंस इन ऑल द थ्री राउंड्स ओके यू विल शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर आइदर वन रोल जेंसी नेक्स्ट जेंसी प्रो एंड जेंसी सो इट इज़ फ्रॉम माई ऑनवर्ड्स सो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द टेक्निकल असेसमेंट इन डिटेल्स वॉट अबाउट द क्लस्टर नंबर वन क्लस्टर नंबर टू क्लस्टर नंबर थ्री प्रोसेस वॉट अबाउट द टेक एग्जामिनेशन पैटर्न वॉट इज द टेक एग्जाम फ्री रिसोर्सेज ओके फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू विल रिसीव दिस टाइप ऑफ मेल फ्रॉम द कॉग्निजेंट टीम अगेन आई एम सेंग दिस इज जस्ट फॉर अ रेफरेंस यू विल रिसीव द सेम मेल ओके यू विल रिसीव द सेम मेल फ्रॉम द कॉग्निजेंट टीम कॉग्निजेंट इन्वाइट्स यू टू द टेक्निकल असेसमेंट दिस इज अ प्रीवियस फेज मेल डियर कैंडिडेट्स ग्रीटिंग्स फ्रॉम कॉग्निजेंट वी आर प्लेस टू शेयर यू हैव बीन शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर कॉग्निजेंट हायरिंग टेक्निकल असेसमेंट एंड ड्यूरेशन ऑफ सेम इज वन ट्वेंटी मिनट्स प्लीज इंश्योर दैट एम एस बी इज डाउनलोडेड एंड टेस्टेड वेल इन एडवांस ऑफ शेड्यूल असेसमेंट ओके क्लिक हर टू डाउनलोड द एम एस बी एंड परफॉर्म द सिस्टम कंपेटेबिलिटी चेक यू हैव टू गिव यू हैव टू डाउनलोड द एम एस बी ओके एंड यू हैव टू परफॉर्म द सिस्टम कंपेटेबिलिटी चेक प्लीज डाउनलोड द लेटेस्ट वर्जन फॉर टेकिंग द टेक्निकल असेसमेंट इन केस यू हैव ऑलरेडी डाउनलोडेड द लेटेस्ट वर्जन प्लीज क्लिक ऑन लॉन्च टेस्ट टू प्रोसीड द बटन वॉट इज रिक्वायर्ड फ्रॉम कैंडिडेट कैंडिडेट करंटली ऑन वर्जन थर्टी टू थर्टी थ्री थर्टी फोर आर रिक्वायर्ड टू अपडेट देयर एम एस बी रन द सिस्टम कंपेटेबिलिटी चेक दिस अपडेट इज एप्लीकेबल ओनली फॉर विंडोज ओ एस ऑल फ्रेश न्यू डाउनलोड्स विल गेट लेटेस्ट बिल्ड वर्जन थर्टी सिक्स बाई डिफॉल्ट सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द गाइडलाइंस यू हैव टू फॉलो दिस दिस इज द इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स दैट यू हैव टू इंस्टॉल एम एस बी एंड परफॉर्म ऑल सिस्टम चेक यू हैव टू यूज द सिस्टम कंपेटेबिलिटी चेक इट इज़ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इंश्योर एंटी वायरस प्रोसेस इन योर सिस्टम इज डिसेबल्ड only one attempt is available hit the start button the start assessment link will only be enabled as per start date and time of assessment do not click f5 or try to refresh the screen doing this will submit and end the assessment assessment has more than one section do not click on finish test button until all sections are completed it is mandatory to attempt all the question please ensure you answer the question in same order you can't go back to previous question once you skip move to the next question if a candidate accidentally moves to the next question after typing a few lines of code they cannot go back to previous question if no code is typed they will not allow to move forward that's the most important thing this is the important points okay it is mandatory to attempt all the question sectional timer is allocated for all the section code skeleton consist of class method function details are provided by default latest query and code submitted will consider for grading ensure the final submission is valid in case of disconnection due to power failure please restart your assessment immediately using same invitation link this is the frequently asked question okay you can read and prior to assessment and this is do's ensure the laptop battery is fully charged take the assessment on desktop laptop equipped with working webcam ensure that the face is clearly visible take webcam prior to assessment okay take the assessment fairly and avoid all mal practices maintain composure even if faced with challenging problem statement or limited time this is don'ts click f5 or try to refresh the screen doing this will auto end the assessment click print screen or try to copy the content use ai platform like chat gpt okay so this is just for a draft or we can say that this is just for a reference you will receive this type of same mail in which your exam date will be there okay and examination time will be there that is the most important thing let's discuss about the next update that is related like many of the candidates are asking how to check which cluster is allocated as we know that there is a cluster number 1 cluster number 2 cluster number 3 cluster number 1 is java cluster number 2 is python and cluster number 3 is c sharp okay so you have to you have to click on start test okay don't worry your test is not started your test will not started you have to click on test start you will see this type of page hi lokesh welcome to hiring tech 25 phase 3 tech cl1 set 6 cl1 means cl1 means cluster number 1 cl2 means cluster number 2 CL3 means cluster number 3 okay from this way you can check which cluster is allocated to you 
okay you have to click on start test don't worry your test is not started okay it will only start on the mention time you will able to see this interface okay this is the interface total five questions are there three sections are there and total 120 minutes of duration similarly if the cluster suppose i allocated like in my case which cluster is allocated the cluster number one okay according to your choosed cluster so this type of cluster will be allocated cluster number three cluster number two cluster number one five question three section okay like this you can check how to check the cluster let's discuss about the cognizant tech examination pattern as we know that there is a registration screening if you cleared your communication assessment will be there in the online assessment aptitude assessment and technical assessment will be round second according to your performance in both the three round communication apt technical you will shortlisted either for one of the role gen c next gen c pro and gen c and after that if you selected letter of intent loi will be there technical assessment prerequisites technical assessment is a mandatory assessment to further move your candidature skill cluster number one okay it is by default suppose at the time of registration if you not choose cluster number two or cluster number three so by default your examination in the cluster number one and you have to give examination on java ncsql html css javascript if you choose the cluster number two or cluster number three they will consider you for cluster number two or cluster number three which will be notified so in the cluster number one okay this is the test pattern coding java programming are there two questions are there query database two questions are there coding web ui one question are there total five question in the cluster number two python two coding questions are there query two questions are there cloud fundamental 10 mcqs are there okay in the cluster number three coding two questions are there query database two questions are there and coding web ui one questions are there total five question so this is the technical assessment cluster number one examination pattern java 2 coding question medium level sql 2 question easy to medium and html css js 1 question easy okay and it is for gen c gen c pro and gen c next okay similarly the time duration for java is 60 minutes 2 coding question for 60 minute sql 35 minutes for 2 query question coding web ui 25 minutes so total 60 35 and 25 okay 10 7 8 9 10 11 120 minutes okay so total 120 minutes duration are there 120 minute time are there okay and this is the parts of uh, like following cluster number one in the cluster number one what are the free resources okay as we know that java is very very important so i suggest everyone to you can go to any of the platform hacker rank or hacker earth and you have to practice the coding question you can see on my screen that this is a uh, point 110 java interview program with solution java programming example and i am sharing the cognizant technical assessment free resources with all the links it is present in description it will very helpful for everyone okay similarly let's discuss about the second part that is sql for the java i already mentioned similarly for sql you can go to hacker rank website you will find the sql section sql section where you will find all the questions okay all the question means beginner related question medium related question and like advanced related question or we can say that medium intermediate and advanced so solve with this sql question it will very helpful for everyone okay and what about the particular html css and java for the coding web ui html css js are there i suggest go to w3 school website it will very very helpful for everyone okay let's discuss about the cluster number two in which python 2 coding question sql 2 question and cloud mcq 10 question okay similarly you can go to uh, geeks for geeks website programming with website java t point website for python okay and you can check the sql query website for the cloud cloud related you can go to the sand foundry website where you will find 1000 plus question okay and similarly for the sql for the sql section go to the hacker rank website okay and solve the question and this is some sql related practice queries question you will find let's discuss about the last that is cluster number three c sharp two coding questions are there you can see on my screen 500 c sharp program c sharp exercise c sharp tutorial okay and similarly for the query database query database sql you can go to hacker rank website or you can find on google 
that SQL queries practice. And for the coding web UI, similarly W3 is cool website for HTML, CSS and JavaScript. I suggest everyone to please check out this video that is related to Cognizant technical assessment live class in this cluster number one, cluster number two, cluster number three process are there. Okay. And this is the previous year question. Like this is the recent question that is related to SQL. Let's discuss about this is SQL question. Write an SQL query to display the name of employee who have more than five years of experience and join after one January. Use alias employee ID employee name and your output should be two column as given below. This is SQL related question. This is coding question. Emily has received a string S which compromise of only X and Y. In order to make it ideal string, she want to remove any repetitive alphabet from the string. This means that one X should follow one Y. A input string written an integer value representing the number of removal. X, Y, X, X, Y, X and X, Y. What is the output? Output is two. The given string is this. There are two places where extra character are present. This is XX and XX. Okay. If we remove the string will be ideal. After remove of two extra character, the string is XY, XY and XY. There are two is the written output means the two different string we removed. This type of question will be asked in your examination. Let's discuss about the coding web UI, HTML, CSS, JavaScript. You have to develop a profile card component. The component can show whether you are following a person or not. Toggle the follow button to unfollow when click. It display the follow status message when following the user. Ensure the design and functionality of provide profile card are uh, correct. Okay. You have to create a paragraph tag. The inner text of paragraph tag should be you are following John Day. Add a border radius. Okay. So this type of question will be asked. Similarly in the cloud MCQ you can uh, practice. Okay. I will tell you one most important thing. This is cluster number one, cluster number two and cluster number three. Cluster number one is Java, rest is SQL and rest is coding web UI. Okay. That is HTML, CSS. Cluster number two, Python. Okay. And same SQL. Okay. And same the cloud MCQs will be there. And in the cluster number three, C sharp, SQL and web UI will be there. So if the by default cluster is same, you have to focus more on Java part, SQL and web UI part. In the Python, the Python, SQL and cloud MCQ. In C sharp, cluster number three, C sharp, SQL and web UI. This is all about the today's video. I hope you like the video and you understand all the process that is related to technical assessment. We will meet in the next video and uh, most probably prepare for opportunity. It is very, very biggest opportunity. Don't miss this. Everything I shared with all of you, I will come up with the technical interview preparation exam result and cutoff. Best wishes for your examination.